for all your stories, do you have like a whole bunch of ideas in your head already, or do you, when you like start to write a book, does it just all come then? It's usually one at a time. Especially, it's gotten harder because I've written so many books. Yeah. And it's usually, I mean, I'm so lucky because every time I need a new, I need a new idea every month. I need an idea a month because I do a book a month. And every time I need one, I get one. Usually from a title. I don't really have ideas in advance, but I, some, I get title ideas. And almost all my ideas come from thinking of a really good title and then seeing where the title leads. And so I'll get, maybe I'll make a list of title ideas and then go back and try to come up with ideas. I think I work backwards from every other author. <laughs> Yeah. Like most authors get an idea for a story and then think of a title later. <laughs> yeah, I just thought like the title was the hardest part. <laughs> well, I do too. That's why I like the title. <laughs> I, you know, if I have a really good title, then I know I don't have to worry about it. Mm -hmm. And sometimes, this is true, I've had really good ideas for stories and I couldn't think of titles for them, so I threw out the idea. Really? Because I knew I'd never come up with a good title. <laughs> <laughs> So, is there a reason that you do that? Just think of the title. It's first, just the way I work. It's just the way I, it works for me. Mm -hmm. You know, I'd be walking down the street. I was walking down, and I thought this title popped in my mind: Brain Juice. Mm -hmm. Brain Juice. And I thought, That's great. It turned out to be one of my favorite Goosebumps books. Mm -hmm. And you know, so I just had this title, and then you, then you start to think about it and say, well, uh, what would happen if uh, kids would drink brain juice? What would happen? To them? <laughs> Maybe they'd get really smart. <laughs> well, what would happen if they would get too smart? Maybe they'd get smarter and smarter, and they'd get so smart no one could stand them. <laughs> and then it would ru what if it, it, it would ruin their lives because they'd be too smart for everyone else, and they couldn't stay in school, and they'd lose all their friends, and, they, and that's how that you know. And then it developed, and then some aliens got in the picture. <laughs> <laughs> but, so that's how it like develops from the title. That just seems to work for me. Yeah.